Hi, I'm going to demonstrate how to use Microsoft Lens to take photos of your handwritten work and then turn them into a single document um, PDF file. You'll be able to crop the images, use filters to improve the quality of the pictures, uh, save it as a PDF, and then if you have the Canvas app installed on your, on your device, you'll also be able to go ahead and directly upload it um, into a Canvas assignment from here. Okay, so I'm using an iPhone for this demonstration. They also have um, an Android app for Microsoft Lens. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is go ahead and install the software. And then after that, go ahead and open up Microsoft Lens. And you're going to have a choice of a whiteboard, document, or business card. Go with the document. And then for my first page, again, when you move this in and out, you can see that red box moving. So when I take this picture, it's processing, and it's going to go ahead and give me a shows me what it looks like. Now notice that all of question three is not in there, so I definitely want to go ahead and crop this one. So if I go up to crop, that's on the top bar, there's a menu, and look, I can go ahead and pull these down or move them over. But notice here, it didn't get all of that in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit cancel, and I'm gonna go ahead and, um, on the top left where you see the X, discard that picture. So let me go ahead and try it again. So again, I'm gonna make sure I get all of that in there. Now it's processing. And again, notice, you know, there's my picture. That looks pretty good. If I go to crop, I could go ahead and drag these circles around and I guess make it a little bit better, but it's, it's good enough. Done. And then also I'm given the option to go ahead and use filters. So filters are nice to brighten it up a little bit. Like that looks pretty good. I remember I have to be able to read this and grade it. So, um, you can play around with the little filters, but whatever you send me, make sure it's going to be easy for me to read and write on. Okay. So once I've Pick a filter I like. On the top bar, there's a little arrow pointing to the left. Click that. Now, if I have um, several pages and I want to do them all at once, I'm going to go ahead and hit Add New. Don't use Done. Hit Add New. And now I'm going to go ahead and take a picture of my second page. And again, try to make sure you get all of it in there. And then I don't really see the need to go ahead and crop this. So I'm going to leave it as it is. But in the filter, I am going to lighten it up a little bit. Okay, so I'm done that. Now those are, I only have the two pages, so I'm finished. So I go ahead and I click done. At this point, I'm going to be able to name my document, um, decide where I want it to be saved and what file type. So again, for me, it's very important that it's going to be a PDF. But let's do the name first. So I'd include, you know, the assignment name. So, you know, quiz four, and then I would also include my last name. Right. And then again, very important that you save it as a PDF. And then for the storage, you can you know decide if you want to put it on your phone or your OneDrive. For now, I'm just going to go ahead and put it on my phone, and it's this document right here. Okay, so I can open up the document. Um, if I do so, I am going to get the option to you know share it from here, and that, that's that button in the upper right. And if I click on that, notice it'll give me some options. And then right down here below, I can you know email it to myself if I need to, or I can go ahead and put it right into the Canvas app here. Okay, so if you don't have the Canvas app, you probably want to go ahead and email it to yourself. That way, when you get on your computer, you can open up Canvas and then upload it to the assignment. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and hit the student app. And now notice it's going to give me the option to pick which course I want to put it into. So go ahead and find our class, whichever class ours it is. All right. um, I'm going to go ahead and pick this one here. And then also, I choose an assignment. So I'm going to go ahead and upload this as quiz four. Right. And the last thing I need to do is hit submit. Right. And that's it. You're all done. If you have any questions or concern, let me know.